Huh. My curious young learners, today we embark on an incredible journey beyond our world. We are going to space. Wait, space? Like the planets? Do we get to visit them all? Of course. And I'll be your guide. Buckle up. Our adventure through the solar system is about to begin. First stop, the sun. It's not a planet, but it's the heart of our solar system. It's a giant ball of super hot gas, burning at about 5,500 degrees Celsius on the surface. That's hotter than a pizza oven, though I wouldn't recommend baking dog treats here. Next up, Mercury, the closest planet to the sun. It zooms around the sun super fast, completing an orbit in just 88 days. 88 days, wow! But it looks so gray and rocky. Now, Venus, this place is tricky. It's even hotter than Mercury, with clouds full of acid. Yikes. Acid? That sounds scary. Oh, home sweet home. Earth is the only planet we know with life. And peanut butter sandwiches. And soccer fields. Next stop, Mars. It's red because of iron dust, like rusty metal. Scientists even send robots here. Cool. Can people live on Mars? So maybe aliens? Maybe tiny Martian microbes. Who knows? This is Jupiter, the biggest planet in our solar system. That's a giant storm, bigger than Earth. It's been raging for over 300 years. That's one windy day I'd stay inside for. Saturn, famous for its rings. But did you know they're made of ice and rock? Could we skate on them? Uranus is a bit of a rebel. It spins on its side. It must have been a big crash. Last stop, Neptune. The farthest planet and the windiest place in the solar system. I bet I couldn't even fly a kite there. Not unless you want it to zoom into space. And that's our solar system. What a ride. That was amazing. I love space. Me too. Maybe one day we'll go for real. Until then, we'll keep learning and exploring. One fun fact at a time. If you had fun today, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more awesome adventures with me, Greta and Leo. Until next time, keep exploring.